Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Thank you so much for popping by. I really do appreciate it. My name is Masi and I'm so excited to have you over. So today I'm going to be reviewing Bounce Travel System. When I was pregnant, we had to shop around for travel system that was best for us. I mean, it's only natural. When you are having a baby, you need to have a travel system. Otherwise, how else are you going to be able to move around with your baby? I've always seen this specific one, um, doing the rounds on Instagram. In fact, I saw it from one mom on Instagram and I thought to myself, this is so beautiful, I need to have it. It looked so, so good. And at the time I was not even pregnant, but I knew that one day when God decides to you know to bless us with a child that was the one for us that was purely based on the fact that it looked good to me and i had honestly fallen in love with it because i loved youtube um i went onto youtube to just find some reviews on it and see how it has basically worked for other moms and basically how it works and i found nothing i didn't find anything then till today there's nothing so now i just figured now that i've used this for just over 13 months how about i just share my experience with it and just my thoughts on how you know the whole travel system works so i can make your buying decision easier so with all of that said if you're a parent what are you expecting or you're just curious and really just to know about this travel system you know its capabilities its pros and cons its price very important as well as what i as a normal mom think of this advanced travel system then please watch this video it may just help you let's get straight to it so this is the structure of the stroller i will be showing you guys how it basically works remember this is my simple brief and basic way to go about it so here we go first things first to lay flat the structure of the stroller you basically pull up the side bars at the same time this will allow it to fold after folding it down you will click that button to lift the handle this allows the stroller to lay flat as you can see, it does not completely go flat, but it will fit in any standard car boot. To take it back up, you will have to open the bottom part to separate the front and the back walls. Lift the handle up until you hear a click. You are also able to extend the height bar based on your comfort. This you do by pressing on the button just underneath the handle. To fit the actual stroller, be sure to insert both sides onto the structure until you hear a click sound. Change it to face front, lift the sidebars to detach the stroller, remove it and insert it back in. The front bar is flexible and can be removed for easy entry. I will give you a closer look shortly. You can also push it down, up or have it stay midway based on baby's comfort. The canopy can also be extended for extra cover on extreme weather conditions. The mesh is best for direct sun protection. Lifting the back bar will enable the stroller to lay flat, allowing the baby to sleep comfortably during a walk. The stroller has ample space and storage. You will see that I took anything that was within my reach to show you just how much storage it has. This is the Bounce car seat, also very nice, comes with seat belts and is well cushioned and padded for extra comfort. The car seat does not have a base, you only strap it using your car's seat belt. 
also very safe if you do it properly. Now to safely strap the baby in, you simply have to pull both belts, rest the right belt onto the left one and insert on the lock pad until you hear a click. To unlock it, simply click on the red button and let loose the belt. It can also be plugged and is compatible with the main structure. This wall over here is basically a guide that will tell you if the car seat is well strapped and properly installed in the car. And at the back there is basically instructions on how to strap the baby car seat in the car. And onto the carry cart, this is the bounce carry cart. Like the stroller, you will want to ensure that it is safely plugged in. This is the closer look at how to insert the bar. You simply press the buttons on the side so it enters smoothly. You will do the same on the other side. The carry cart has its cushioned cover for when it's cold and drizzly. To remove it, simply pull it off the clips gently. This is the inside of the carry cart. Very, very, very comfortable. The mattress sheet is also removable for easy wash. And to put back the cover, simply clip it back on. Easy. This is a closer look on the texture of this travel system. Very, very, very beautiful. It screams luxury. It's really stunning. get to it the price how much is this bra? i'm sure you've been wondering how much this thing is so it's a two-in-one system um, basically there's a stroller as well as the bassinet they also call it um, a carry cart whatever feels good for you so that one comes at 8,500 rand the car seat however is sold separate and it goes for 1,500 rand so if you want this travel system be sure to part with at least 10,000 rand the pros what is it that's so good about this stroller? Let's find out. Well, at least according to me, these are what I find interesting about the stroller. I like that it looks good. There's nothing more to it. It looks nice. Very pleasing to the eye, honestly. I like the fact that it has storage. You're able to fit some things there. The baby's toy, the food for the day. You're able to store some things there. Also the fact that it's front and rear facing. So mom or dad is able to have a baby face them while walking within the estate they can you know have the baby face front so they're able to just explore the world around them 
actually i also like that it has the front bar a very flexible front bar that bar is obviously for the baby to be able to hold on to something as well as for easy entry so you're able to clip it off so you can have the baby seat and then you clip it on again so obviously the baby is locked in the cons hmm. the bounce travel system does not have a cup holder doesn't have a cup or a bottle holder i mean you need some way to put the baby's bottle when walking so i don't understand the car seat is not practical at all <laughs> we used it until about seven eight months after that the baby is so big and it's literally an infant car seat so buy the car seat at your own risk i wouldn't recommend anyone to actually buy the car seat because it is not practical literally you are going to be using the car seat for about six months of the baby's life and after that you won't be using it again so i think that's a waste of money but also that's preference i've seen many strollers have what they call a snack tray um, you see where we have the flexible front bar that's where the snack tray is i think it's very convenient because imagine walking around the mall you're shopping with your baby and you're trying to keep them entertained or just you know snack they don't have a tray so basically they just eat on them and they mess and it becomes a problem so i think a snack tray is something the buns brand should actually think about last con that i can think about in my head right now is that it is expensive well it could be a con it could not be a problem for other people but yeah it's it's not it's not a cheap travel system it's literally ten thousand rand so you need to save up and make sure that you have that money to be able to buy this travel system and overall it really looks good and we enjoy it i still love it um our son still uses it well only the stroller because now he's big but the carry cart you can't use it for long as well but that goes for all brands it's not necessarily the bounce brand and that is it thank you so much for watching i hope you really did enjoy this video if you did enjoy it please give it a thumbs up please also leave a comment down below and let me know what exactly you look at when buying a stroller or travel system please also share this video with all the moms that you know and are actually shopping around for this particular one otherwise that is it for me guys i'll see you on my next video Mwah.